The South African National Rally Championships returns after a delay due to the COVID-19 pandemic. It's wreaked havoc with the schedule, but I'm glad to say that racing continues this weekend at Lake Umuzi in Secunda. And joining me is the reigning champion. He's a four-time national champion, Toyota Gazoo Racing driver Guy Bottrell. Guy, thanks so much for your time. It must feel good after so many months to be back racing. It's uh, really good to be out there again. Um, you know, it's been a long break. Uh, we did a bit of testing last weekend just to make sure the car was good. But uh, I think we're ready. Uh, the crew's done a good job on the car and uh, it's just now time to get out there and uh, put some uh, kilometres under our belt again. How important is it uh, for, for Rally to, to get started again because of the delay that you've had and considering that there's so much interest across the African continent? Uh, across Africa there's a huge following. Uh, we're fortunate enough to do the African Rally Championship. Uh, we got the first round in in Ivory Coast. Uh, that was a phenomenal event for us, a steep learning curve, uh, learning African ways of doing rallying. But it was a phenomenal, fantastic experience and uh, we just learned a hell of a lot there. And unfortunately COVID hit and uh, everything got shut down and this is our first event after, after lockdown. Tell us uh, the Safari Rally back in the WRC. It's, it's, a, it's a huge feather in the cap for African Rally. Correct. Uh, it's fantastic that uh, the WRC is coming back to the African continent, uh, especially coming to Kenya. There's a massive following in Kenya for, for rallying. Um, so it's just going to be really exciting when it eventually does come. They've postponed it to next year. So uh, I, I think it's going to be a uh, bit of an eye-opener for everybody, uh, especially uh, the African guys going to take part in it again. Uh, we're going to have a go at it. Uh, it was part of our plan to um, you know, do it this year, but we postponed that for next year. And I think it's just a huge privilege. Uh, you know, It's always been a dream for us to partake in a WRC, and now it's coming to Africa, our home, so uh, you know we've got to get out there and give it a go. So we're really looking forward to it. What do you make of the South African rally scene at the moment? Because it's a sport that's 60 years old in South Africa. It's steeped in, in history. Uh, but it's it's sort of struggled of late. With with all motorsports, you know, there they, they goes their times, ups and downs. And I really believe uh, Rally has had its down. Uh, we've got a fantastic driving committee behind Rally at the moment. And uh, all the guys that are in rallying at the moment are in it for the benefit of Rally. Um, so I think Rally is going to go from strength to strength. Um, there, there were big plans for Rally this year. Unfortunately, all got put on hold. Uh, and, and we back rallying, but un unfortunately we're not allowed spectators. They're limiting the amount of people in the pits. So uh, unfortunately this year you won't see the full effect of the new committee and all the plans that they had. But I really believe going forward that uh, rally is going to go from strength to strength. Lastly, um, uh, your team is obviously active in the Dakar rally. We've seen Janelle de Villiers, uh, Nassal Atia, Fernando Alonso. Is that somewhere you, you're aiming to be or aspiring to be as, as on the Dakar one day? Oh, I'd love to go to the Dakar. Uh, you know, it's always also one of my dreams to get there. But, uh, you know, we, we're just focusing on what's uh, coming at the moment. This year has been turned upside down. So, um, you know, our, our 2020 plans have now moved to 2021. So, uh, 2021, we're just focusing really hard on the African Rally Championship. That's another thing is our points from the Ivory Coast have moved forward. So, we're actually winning the 2021 African Rally Championship. And uh, we're just using these three races in South Africa in preparation for that. Uh, so we learn the car, we understand the car a bit better. So yes, Dakar is certainly something that uh, we would love to do. But uh, definitely for 2021, it's uh, ARC, the South African Rally Championship and the Kenyan WRC that we're really focusing on. Well, we wish you all the best and uh, keep flying the flag for South Africa and uh, on the continent. And we look forward to seeing you in action. Thank you so much. Thanks, man.